I want to tell everyone that does biology, your degree is not real. How much work do you think you do every week? Maybe like four hours a week. Four hours a week. I wouldn't like, I would lick my own foot, but I wouldn't lick someone else's foot. Hello, uh, who am I here with? Adam. Nice to meet you, Adam. Is it one A or two A's? It's two A's. Okay, cool. It's because nice. my mum would be at the start of the register, <laughs> so she put two A's in my name. You already would have been at the start. You're, you're beating out the one person called Aaron, <laughs> and that's it. No, we did my surname, so I'm like near the bottom. <laughs> oh, right. Didn't even work. So, Adam, nice to meet you. And what do you study? PPE. And what college? Queen's College. Good college. Very beautiful college. And what year are you in? I'm a fresher. Nice. Okay, so how are you finding Queen's so far? Yeah, it's really nice. Everyone there is, everyone there is really nice. But how, how, how's the food at Queen's? Food? Yeah. The hall is nice. A lot of people complain about it though. We've got some serial complainers at our college. They know who they are. They don't like any of the meals there, but I think it's really, really good. I've heard that the meals are really good, but they're really complex and there's not enough food. It's not English. They're, the words they use, I've never heard before <laughs> the, for the meals. The, I don't understand what's happening. I have no clue. That sounds like fancy. That sounds good. I want to know what I'm eating. Just, just, just tell me, just tell me, just tell me chicken. <laughs> don't, don't give me some yeah, sauté, fair, grilled, fair, charred. I don't, fair. Just tell me chicken. Sorry, that guy walked by and he was like trying to take the slyest photo ever, but it wasn't really? remotely <laughs> sly. I'm used to it at this point, you know, used to the yeah, You are a celebrity. Yeah, well, I know. Everyone knows you. So how are you finding PPE? Compared to everyone else, I have no work. I just go around badgering people about how much time they spend in the library. That makes sense yeah. for future prime ministers. We do nothing. I do nothing. My my lectures are across the road. Yeah. So I wake up at 10 a.m. I have no 9 a.m. So wake up at 10. Nice. Roll across the street. Are you skipping a lecture to be here? Yeah. Yeah, good, good. How many lectures do you have a day? I have three on Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Okay. And that's it. An hour long each? Yeah, just an hour each. Okay, so like nine hours per week. Yeah, but they're all this term. Like, I'll have no, no I'll have none next Oh, time. really? Yeah, because they're doing all of them now. How much work do you think you do every week? Not much. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe like four hours a week. Four hours a week. I, I, I would say, is that on top of is that on top of lectures? But you don't even go to your lectures. No, no, you're, no, you're, you're, you sound like I don't go to any lectures. <laughs> okay, okay. I go to some of them. Okay, fair. But you go to you have tutorials as well, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. and you do work for your tutorials and like essays. But I only have I, only, I do less essays than the biologists. Wow, I'm sure. It'll, well, actually, am I sure it will pick up? It might not pick up. I don't know. You might. I hope never not. have to. I'm chilling. <laughs> Good old Oxford PPE degrees. <laughs> what degree do you think is the biggest red flag? The biggest red flag. Because mm, a lot of people would say PPE. You. Oh, this is a hard one. Yeah. I would say biology. Okay. I would say biology. Why? Because their degree is not real, but they think it is. <sighs> I got shown that one of their assignments, they had to draw a picture of a mantis and it got graded. <laughs> You're telling me that's a real degree? No that's way. That's not a real degree. <laughs> that's How is some that? geography. Yeah, level. that's geography. <laughs> geography is also, yeah. Okay, geography's up there. You wouldn't see that in PPE. You just don't get graded in PPE at all. There's no work to There's do. There's no work to do, yeah. Do you think the accusations about PPE are fair? Well, name of the accusations I first. don't know, you know, that everyone's posh, everyone's a bit of a... Um, Go on. Well, I can't say it on camera. A tosser. Everyone wanting to be prime minister, way too intense, that kind of stuff. Everyone wanting to be prime minister. I feel like no one would say it. Okay. But people people are definitely going for it. Yeah. No one would say it though. What's the wildest thing you've experienced from a PPE student so far? It's the way you know that someone's talking to you just to make a connection just with you. Just a network. Just, yeah, just, yeah. just to be transactional. Yeah. And you can see right through yeah. it. You can see right through it. The way <laughs> they speak. Like... They're not trying to be your friend. They're just trying to be your acquaintance. What, what, what do your parents do? Oh, okay. They, they don't. Oh, wait, they're, they're not political advisors. Okay. Nice meeting you. So what do your parents do? Oh, they're in a trust fund. Oh, lovely to meet you. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> What's the most Oxford thing you've experienced? Yeah. Most Oxford thing. Yeah. I had a crew date. Do you want to explain what a crew date is? A crew date is basically when either with your course or with your college, you all go down and you just play games and get to know each other. You do like a bunch of different Oxford traditions. So you have to throw pennies in each other's cups. You have to put shoes on your head. And if, you do, if you're the last to put the shoe on your head? Yeah, you have to drink out of your shoe, mm. which is a bit grim. I've seen some horrible sh shoes. I've seen some, yes. oh God. Okay, so do you know Angra Thai? No. I, I was in there for food. Yeah, yeah. And then there was a crew date going on. I went and asked them how how it was having a crew date there and they were like oh you're that tiktok guy and i was just chatting to them for a bit and then they were like shoe and then so everyone put their and, so you head. Do shoe. and then i i was obviously like i'm not a part of this i'm not doing that and, and they then they were like that. no you gotta do a shoe you gotta do a shoe they gave me their shoe <laughs> to do a shoe out of that's horrible it's disgusting guys would you rather do it out of your own shoe and suffer the consequence of 
having soggy socks? Or would you rather do it out of someone else's shoe not knowing where I'd they've been? I'd much rather do it out of my own shoe. I wouldn't, like, I would lick my own foot, but I wouldn't lick someone else's foot. But then you have soggy socks. I, I can deal with soggy socks. Like, that is disgusting. Drinking out of someone else's shoe. Nah, there is no debate here. I don't know. You think you'd rather drink out of someone else's if shoe? If it means I'm going home with the nice woolly socks on. But also, it's not even going to be that soggy, because most of the oh, liquid's no, like... No, 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 no. It was horrible. Yeah. I could hear a squelch every time I stepped. Well, my back, but... fair enough. I guess your shoes are more absorbed. Yeah. than mine. What unis did you apply to? I applied to here, LSE, UCL, Kings and Warwick. Yeah. Did you get into all five? No. <laughs> <laughs> I got rejected from LSE and UCL, but I got into okay. LSE. How did you choose which unis to apply to? I'll be so real. I just searched up top five PP unis and then just chucked it on the UCAS. People were spending too yeah. much time like making spreadsheets. What do you think people would say you study? I don't think people would say I study here at all, to be honest. <laughs> we had this conversation actually. We were all going around saying when we saw each other, what do we think we studied? Yeah. I got a lot of maths, I think. Okay. Which I wasn't very pleased about. That seems a bit racially charged. Yeah. Though, I'm like. Yeah. Yeah. There was a, there was a. I was a bit. I was a bit like maths. Yeah. Really? <laughs> bit of an obvious. You could have. Could have been nice. You could have gone. You could have gone English or something <laughs> like that. But you decided to just be really obvious. When you go maths. All right. So you think people say maths? What's the best? What's the best subject? to study it. Medicine. Let's okay. say medicine. All right. That means okay. I'm smart, right? Are you sure? Also racially charged, perhaps. <laughs> but... but I'd rather that than that. <laughs> exactly, yeah. exactly. If you only had an hour to live, what would you do? Basically? So I'm in my accommodation, I've got told I have an hour to live. Yeah. Well, I think like there's the boring answer and then there's the not so boring answer, which is boring answer is you kind of call your mum and you, you have a little chat and you go to her and you see That's her. That's sweet. And the not so boring answer is like... Boring <laughs> down Queens. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. You have a week to live. Week to live. Live. I would go to all my lectures, I would go to my tutorials, I'd make sure all my assignments were turned in on time, I would do my extracurriculars, this... I'd go to hall, I would socialise with everyone, I would make sure I'm a good, good student and represent Oxford and then pa right. pass away. So why don't you do that already? Because I don't have a week to live, baby. <laughs> <laughs> wow, well, that you know of. Wow, that's that's so of. that I know of. Okay, Is that a crazy. threat? Last year you have a, a year to live. A year to live? Yeah. How can you already plan what you're going to do in a year? That's, that's difficult. That's really difficult. I think go travelling around the world. Just, yeah, yeah. Just see the whole world. Go to every country. That's a good answer, no? I think so. What would your answer be? Cry. Cry. I'd spend a lot of time crying, I reckon. Nah, I would spend a lot of it doing gymnastics. You do gymnastics? Yeah. Actually, I've seen the video of you, you and Barty are hench. You guys are, you guys are pretty strong. Barty's hench. Barty's hench. I'm... Nah, I've seen a little. I've seen, I've seen some biceps. <laughs> I've seen them. I've seen them. Don't... <laughs> I would do a lot of gymnastics, I would travel, and I'd try to do something of social utility. I'd probably talk more about my research online than I do, that's which is vaccine a, an disinformation. Answer. It is, but also, like, my research is... I'm one of very few people that studies this kind of thing, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so publicizing it more would be the best way for me to have the most positive impact on the world. Yeah, yeah. How selfless of you. But I don't do it. So, like, I could just be doing it anyway, but I'm not doing it. So <laughs> why am I doing it with yeah, exactly. Anything else you want to say to the camera? I want to tell everyone that does biology, your degree is not real. That's it. <laughs> Wonderful. Thank you. Can you take one of your own? Is that fine? Yeah, of course. Okay. Of course. <laughs>